Hi, I'm Simon Gerrans. I'm here at the Shimano Experience Project in Wollongong. It's a 2022 UCI Road World Championships. And right here with me, I have Luke Platt's bike. Now Luke Platt, he is one of the most exciting riders in the peloton. First year professional, he's the current Australian champion. Last year he raced with the Inform team, so it's a domestic team in Australia, but also has always had a big focus on the track. Luke has recently finished the Vuelta Espana. I imagine he's pretty tired. Now Luke is racing for the Ineos Grenadiers team. As you can see by his bike, green and gold, current Australian champion, which is a real honour. Now Luke Flapp, he grew up in Melbourne, but one of the unique things about Luke, he went to a sports school, but not as a bike rider, as a cricketer. Found cycling a little bit later on, developed through the Brunswick Clinic, and he's followed that clinic all the way through the Australian team, and now finally in the professional ranks. Now for me, this is one of the coolest bikes in the Pro Peloton. Not only has it got the green and gold, but if you look at the position, you can see the drop between the, the, the seat to the handlebars, it's huge. So you've got to be super flexible to run this position. That's something that only the pros can do. Look at his handlebars here, how rolled in he has his levers. This is so Luke can curl over the front of his bike, riding on the front or in breakaways in a really aerodynamic position. Now Luke obviously has a big emphasis on aerodynamics. You can see he has an integrated handlebar and stem. He's running the C60 wheels, which is Shimano's aerodynamic road wheel. His, his tires, he's running a 25 mil front tire, yet a 28 mil rear tire. Again, so that's gonna be for aerodynamics. Another thing with the tires, he's running tubeless as well. So able to use a much lower tire pressure. Now let's take a quick look at Plappy's drive chain. So he is running a 54 40 tooth combination front chain rings, an 11.30 at the back. He's running 172.5 millimeter cranks and a Shimano power meter. So these big chain rings, that is the reason why we're having such high average speeds in the races these days. Now taking a look here at Plappy's brakes, there's quite a lot of play here before the brakes engage. So I thought more than I was expecting. And looking at his rotors, there's only a couple of teams in the World Tour Peloton that run 140 millimeter front rotors. Plappy, they're using the standard 160 millimeter front rotor and the 140 at the back. Taking a few measurements here of this Pinarello Dogma F frame set, 55 centimeter frame with deep wheels, it weighs in at 7.56 kilos, 771 millimeter seat height, and he's running 140 millimeter stem. Now this is the bike that Plappy's gonna race here on Sunday at the World Championships in Wollongong.